בביטחון וביום אחרון ובחיי דחור בית ישראל. Vegas eyes. And also her face here in the chin and the cheeks. You hurt in my arm. What, a little old woman like me can hurt your arm. You're a softy. Not like Vega. Vega wasn't soft. None of us were. None of us wanted to live. <laughs> you think that's bad? You should see the rest of me. A boy gave them to me, a soldier. He found out where we were hiding, all of us. He, he told me if I didn't do what he wanted, he would tell them how to find me. So I did what he wanted. And every time he finished, he gave me another mark with his knife. I don't know why. My father, my brothers, they knew what was happening and they did nothing. Your grandmother was in a hiding place with us. But she was alone. We didn't know her, her family, nothing. She didn't like me. She never said one word to me. And I don't blame her. I was a vain little girl. I brought a makeup kit from home, all kinds of little tchotchkes. One day, I noticed my nail file was missing. Well, I didn't give it much thought. Until one night, when everyone was asleep, I woke up and heard a sound. She was sitting in the corner with her hands by her mouth. She was sharpening her teeth on my nail file like this. Jacob! Are you crazy? How dare you frighten him like that? How dare you? 